Good morning everyone, how are you doing? I hope you had a really nice Christmas. Um, today I'm at Westfield North Lakes. I'm also on the market for some um, solitaire created diamond ring. Um, I'm planning on going to a shop called Secret Shh. Secret Shh. I think that's how you say it. They don't make real diamond, but they make created diamonds. So the diamonds actually grown in, in the lab. So if I decided to buy it, I will unbox it with you guys. I'll probably unbox what I bought today anyway, if I buy anything. Um, I'm not actually looking for anything in particular. So um, yeah. So yeah, okay. I'm gonna go now and um, I'll see you inside. time for unboxing the stuff that I bought on Boxing Day. So I bought three things. Um, the first thing I bought is this dress. I really like this one actually. Um, it's quite flattering. Like it's very modest at the front, but it's fun at the back. <laughs> so um, yeah, this one is actually 30% off. So this is um, clear on sale. So yeah, I've got, I think the full price was 89. I think I got it about 60 something. So yeah happy with this um, in the camera it looks a little bit white but it's actually really pale baby blue I also bought this can you see this is OPI um, nail polish the color is very very nude I actually already used it um, yesterday okay this is a um, a bag that I got from Colette Colette Heyman store and they sell um, jewelry um, of cheap jewelry and they also sell cheap um, handbag um, the quality is okay I wouldn't say great probably more on the medium side um, if you're a designer lover 
then you probably notice that this is inspired by um, Louis Vuitton petit mail I think I'm not sure or trunk bag so yeah but I used to have this one with a different color but I stopped using it. I actually ended up giving it to the op shop because it doesn't fit my phone. I also come with um, straps so you can wear it uh, crossbody. I was going to wear it today but um, decided not to. It's a little bit too um, dressy. The last one that I bought that's to me is the most exciting. It's a big solitaire diamond ring but it's not real diamond. It's a created diamond. The shop that I got it from is um, Secrets. Okay, so when you buy it, it comes with um, this certificate. Although you can't sell it, so I don't know why you would have certificate. Oh, it's for um, warranty. And then they also give you um, like a catalog book. And then it comes in this um, pretty box. Okay, and... There it is. Hope you can see it. I hope it's not too bright. So yeah, the clarity is really good as well. So I'm pretty happy with my purchase and I've got it on Boxing Day sale um, discount, which is 25% off. So I'm pretty happy with that. That's all I've got from the Boxing Day sale. Okay, bye. So the barbecue essential, great northern for Todd and seltzer, passion fruit for me, seltzer, basically flavoured soda water. Now we haven't put that on straight, um, we're using that but it's mixed with a bit of hot water so it works as a baste as well so we can get it right in there and it doesn't burn as quick. Juicy. How good is that steak sauce? Mm. <laughs> oh my god, these are good.
I think they're an Australian company. So their diamond is not real diamond, they're lab grown diamond. To me, it's the same as cubic zirconia. Just like diamond, cubic zirconia comes in different range and quality. So this is the high-end cubic zirconia. See, this is how they explain it to me. Um, because I asked the shopkeeper, um, why should I buy your um, fake diamond when I can buy the same fake diamond or cubic zirconia from other jewelers for probably a third of the price. And then she explained to me that they cubic zirconia is of a higher grade. So if it's one to five, theirs is um, on the five range. But the one that you get from other shops, mostly they're around three to four apparently. Oh, before I carry on, um, I'm just gonna show it to you. Sorry guys, I, I can talk about jewelry forever. <laughs> All right, so <laughs> continue on to why I prepared to pay quite a bit more money for this um, created diamond is because one is the quality of the cubic zirconia is a high one and also because the quality of the cut as well I actually brought my jewelers loop to the store when I bought it so I can have a really good look um, off the cut I actually brought my other cubic zirconia that to me is of a good quality I so I thought but then she pointed out to me why this my old ring was um, of a low um, quality cut is because the bezel around the diamond is cut quite thickly where this is very thin and I can literally see it through my jeweler's loop. It actually catch the light a lot better and therefore a lot sparklier and gives off a white color diamond. And the third reason for buying my ring from Secret is because I don't have $30,000 disposable income to pay for a real 3 carat diamond ring. And even if I do, I don't think I can justify spending that much money on a real diamond when my naked eyes can't even tell the difference. And that is why I decided to buy my ring from Secret. 